Hey everybody, full blown disclosure, I forgot to totally record my intro and outro for this video you're getting ready to watch, so that's why my hair is different today. However, you're gonna love it. Um, this kid, uh, he had a soccer injury. Um, this happens a lot and, and kids lose their toenails, adults lose their toenails from running or any kind of sport you're doing where you're like banging those toes. Well, anyway, um, years ago, banged his toe, toenail fell off and then now you can see what it's turned into. So if that happens to you and you're getting an injury, please call me because I can make sure you're not gonna end up with this toenail um, that's coming at you. I mean, anything we can do to prevent it will help you in the long run. So I hope you enjoy the video. Just find a little opening because a lot of it, like I said, is not even attached. So a little clip and it will start releasing because I can see on the tip of it, it's sticky. It's uh, starting to dig into your skin. Really? Mm-hmm. And so once that happens, you know, you're at risk for an infection. Oh, so you can okay. see just a few clips. Ew. And that's what's underneath. <laughs> you can really see there's quite a bit not attached. This, I think, is just sock uh -oh. debris. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> see, aren't you glad we did it? But you can see yeah. here the lines in the skin, how it was getting ready to penetrate in deeper. This may be a little tender, but I just want to get it back as much as possible. Right. So are you, uh, so you said baseball? Yeah. Are you, um, is that like, what is it, <laughs> minor league? I don't even know. I'm a football fan. I'm horrible about baseball. Uh, no, I play in college right now. Oh, okay. I'm, uh, I play at a junior college in uh, Fairfield, Illinois. Basically in the middle of nowhere. In the middle of nowhere. Yeah, pretty much. Um, so yeah. I grew up in the middle of nowhere. I get it. So yeah, a lot of yeah. this is coming off. So the topical you're going to use is going to help kind of keep things nice and soft and thin. It's called repair. Okay. And also get the Dremel on here to really smooth down the rough edge. But we talked about removing it once you kind of get a break in your. Um, with baseball yeah, that, that it won't take long off for it to heal yeah that's the thing I don't know if we're really if now's a good time yeah you know and uh, cause I don't see if it's not painful it's not hurting it's not painful. this little guy here Was this painful for you at all? What are you doing now? No, 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 before. Just whenever you're playing or walking around. Nope. That's why I, I didn't really like my hair. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. You got to please mom. I get it. Yeah, for sure. Well, this will be, you know, you won't have to worry about it bothering you for a while. So good thing you did come in. Yeah. Plus you had that debris under there. You know, which really can put you at risk for an infection. Yeah. So I'm glad that we got a chance to clean that out too. Yeah. Thanks for doing it. Of course. And, and like I said, you honestly don't have to do anything to it. Mm -hmm. You can leave it alone and we can kind of just keep it trimmed like this because it's just cosmetic. But if you're, you know, you're young and healthy, so I get it if you kind of want to a nail that's going to be normal long term because otherwise you're stuck with this for the rest of your life. Stuck like this? Yeah. I'll be okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> but there you go. People don't really look at your feet that much. Exactly. It'll be our secret. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> And you can get an um, old toothbrush when you get home as well to uh, clean out some of this debris in these edges here. Okay. We may, so we have a, um, a kit already put together. I think that would be helpful for you because it has a curette in there. Um, if you just kind of, if, if that's gonna be our plan moving forward just to manage it, we can get you some, you know, medical grade equipment 
and instruments to, to be able to do it on your own. It's got a rasp in there too, so you can kind of roughen up that top before you put that topical on, and this will really help thin it out. All right. Okay, so this is, the, um, like I said, the repair. The biggest thing with this is it's gonna thin it. It's got urea in it, so urea is a great agent to kind of keep it thin okay. because as it gets thicker, it's gonna get more uncomfortable in your shoe, especially your cleat when you're playing because there's just not a lot of wiggle room in there. Okay. There you go. Give that just a couple minutes to dry right. um, and then we'll get you out of there. And why don't you just call me whenever you need me? Okay. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, comment below, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time.